All right, so uh, today's video, today's stream, literally what I've been doing for the last couple days while I was off stream, I finished most of them, obviously not all completed, but I finished the most important things and I pretty much grinded up to 9,000 gems. Now I realized the problem after getting to 9,000 gems is that because I've been grinding for the last couple days, I no longer have any secret packs. But luckily, so I was thinking about it, right? And I'm like, luckily we have everything we need for ABC in terms of the main deck, so in terms of pullable things. And then all we really need to do is kind of just like get a lot of these staples. Now the problem is a lot of these staples are ultra rare. So we have 9,000 gems. The goal is essentially to get a lot of these staples and how we're gonna do that, even though I know it's not the best option, is to go into one of these bigger sets. Actually, does Thor have anything we need? It does have Galaxy Soldier, which is pretty good for us, but I don't want to go into this for just Galaxy Soldier. So maybe here's the play, actually. You know what? Actually, yeah, you know what? Here is the play. We're going to go into Stalwart. I'm going to go into Stalwart here real quick just to see if we can get the Galaxy Soldier. But if we do end up pulling any of the other Ultra or Super Rares, what I'll do is I'll just get rid of most of them so that I can craft everything we need. Okay, so I guess we are going to... I mean, I have 9,000 gems, so... We might as well use them up, right? As soon as we finish the deck, we go straight into ranked and we're just literally grinding rank the entire time. Ooh, we got something. Ooh, we got something. Ooh, ooh, okay. See, this is good. This is why I like, oh, this is, a yo. I like that. Even though it's it has to be Numeron Network. Like it couldn't have been the Golden Lord, man. It had to have been the Numeron Network, which is kind of annoying. But three ultra rares in one pack is insanely good. That's a lot of dust for us, actually, funny enough. We got this is a good, this is a good opening. We got a lot of dust here. Alright, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go back into Stalwart one more time. Uh, we're gonna hope for a Galaxy Soldier here. I'm actually kind of excited for this. This looks really pretty. Uh, maybe the nightmare stuff as well. I'll craft. What is this? Ooh, Shurag, nice. We take that. Let's go into our next one here. We got another ultra rare actually. Oh, nice! I don't mind getting some uh some staples in here. What's in here? Deania, Fractal, and we got, we're getting ultra rares off the wazoo, Faker, nice. All right, super rare, Galaxy Soldier, please. Oh, network. Oh, it's an ultra rare though. I mean, I'll take this dust. I really want a super rare Galaxy Soldier here. Ultra, banger. Oh, another Shurag, nice. We can actually low keys build Tri Brigade. Servant, okay. Good uh, dust here, to be honest, more than anything. I really want the super rare to be Galaxy Soldier, please. Oh, Teratops not bad, but Galaxy Soldier would be nicer. That's three sure eggs in one opening, by the way. That's three sure eggs in one opening. ABC bro f is expensive as shit because everything is from different sets. At least the at least the extra deck. The main deck is not that bad. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go one more Star War, and then if not, we should have enough stuff to craft what we need. And you know what would be better than one Galaxy Soldier? Two Galaxy Soldiers. Not a Galaxy Soldier, but that's fine. We just need one. Alright, I can't be mad. Like, it's not Galaxy Soldier, but I can't be mad. Uh, dust, dust, dust. Alright, we're at 6,700 though. We're gonna go maximum twice on this. Only twice. Maximum twice on this. If anything, it's gonna give us dust more than anything. See? Dust. Banger. No. Banger. Nothing. Okay, any upgrades? Any upgrades, people? Any upgrades? No. We're getting a lot of super rare dust, which is nice, but there's gonna be a lot of ultra rares. In I know it's a very long shot, but Imperm. Oh, it's a trap too. Why is this an ultra rare? Come on. Come on now. Bruh. This is just getting worse. I don't want to go into master pack anymore. I just want to finish this deck and we go straight into ranked. Oh, upgrade. Oh, sh Yo. Yo. Oh, this might be usually really good for us. This one has Kaijus and you're guaranteed some cards. We're doing this one. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go a thousand into this one. We want Gamma Seals anyways. Oh, this looks pretty good. Yeah, we're gonna go, we're gonna try to get Gamma Seals here or any Kaijus. Really Gamma Seals is the best one, but any Kaijus is probably what we're gonna go for. Oh, nice, Jizukiru. Nice, Dust. You know what we call this? Dust. Good, that was nice. Sage is Dust. Morphotronic is Dust. All right, three supers. Ooh, one, two, 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 two. No, Jackalope's good though. Two. Ah, okay. That's Dust. Gamma Seal's good though. I'm not mad with that. Upgrade, upgrade, upgrade. Nope, yes. Ooh, big four. Maybe one more Gamma Seal. Ooh, whole pack upgrade. Whole pack upgrade. Anything could be anything at this point. No, it's nothing actually. Ooh, not bad. I mean, I don't want Slumber. I'd rather other cards. Ooh, 
Humongous. Yo, this is a good pack. Okay, we need one Gamma Seal here. I don't know what the hell, what that is. Okay. Oh, two Bigfoots. So I got a lot of dust. All right, let's generate Phoenix because I don't mind having extra Phoenixes. So let's generate Phoenix. That's also going to give us a free pack and we're going to open on this too. Actually, yo, if we pull one and we end up pulling the Unicorn by... If we end up pulling the Unicorn in one pack, that's big. Oh, it's the Griffin. It's the Griffin, bro. Damn. I spent a thousand gems just for dust, to be honest. All right, we're gonna go one more. Last one. Okay, I'm gonna spend my last 2,000 and then we'll see where it goes. Okay, I'm done with this set though. We have the Cerberus. I'll just craft the other thing. This is the Neg, but I'm doing it. I got a lot of secret packs from that though, actually. But I don't need any of these. I'm gonna go into this then. And hopefully we pull the access code. And if not, everything else get dusted. Axe code or bust, let's go. I just spent 9k, by the way, today. I mean, I, I went through most of the... There's literally three ultra rares in the set, or four. And that's the one I get. Okay, we have chances, we have chances, we have chances. One access code is all it takes. Banger. Guys, I'm gonna snap. We have two ultras from the set. That's 50% chance to get access code. And we got two that were not access code. There's, you're not telling me we're getting three ultras and we're gonna get the three that are not. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> Bro, there's four ultras in the set. There's four ultras in the set. And the three we pulled are not a single access code. I swear to God. Oh, okay. Hoo, hoo, hoo. I need that. I use, I can use that. Thank God, man. Okay. Oh, we have one more chance. 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 I think we have one more chance. Underworld's Goddess is very good. I'm very happy with Underworld Goddess. All right, super rare. You super rare. All right, I didn't expect anything from those two either. Access code. Yes! 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 Ooh, a thousand gems for two actually. That's really good. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, yo, we pulled one, two, three, four, five ultra rares there. The best part about it is three of them are gonna get right into going into dust. But two really big hits here. All right, we're gonna do 1,000 of this, by the way, just for to try to get the infinity. Hopefully, we can get the infinity here. Because once we get the infinity, are the rest of the things that we have chances. Funny enough, the cyber dragon stuff is actually pretty low rarity because some of the high rarity slots are like cyber and dragon and stuff, which are not actually being played in the deck. Over dragon is really good. And yes, that's it. That's it. That's all we needed. That's all we needed. Oh, we got a we got a construct too, and we so we got more ultra rare dust. Here is our first iteration of ABC. Not 100% completely ready, but this is what we're getting into. Let's get into ranked, finally. Let's go five plus win streak. I think we can do it. I mean, the problem is, okay, so this is the like the love hate that I have with something like, oh my God. This is the problem that I have with like low rated is that you see stuff like this and automatically these are useless. We have nothing in our hands, so we have to go six. The nice thing about going six is we have a bunch of stuff we don't need. Let's go straight for the hanger. I really doubt this guy has Ash. Goat format be like, this is actual goat format though. All right, so let's go hanger. Oh, feels good to play a real deck. Oh my God. You guys don't understand while I was grinding through solo mode, it, it made my life like so difficult playing that like random PK things we had through together. But now we actually have a real deck. Here we go into IP ABC pass. IP ABC set the cyclone, set the chalice pass. Uh, we break his whole board. Yeah, we, I knew we were going to win that. We, regardless of whether he scooped up or not, I knew he was going to scoop it up as soon as he saw. Um, yeah, we finish on IP Buster and we, we break his entire board, to be honest. Ooh, OCG player. Oh my god, we keep winning. But the best thing about this deck is that if we win the the, 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 the coin flip or we lose, we're always going second. Like, it's so lit. Okay, um, to be honest, I don't want to use my evenly, but I guess we have to. I'm going to go evenly here. He's probably going to keep the Dryden't. Yeah, yeah. So what's going to happen is I'm going to go evenly. He's probably going to keep the Dryden't. I'm going to Chalice the Dryden't, and then I full combo. Oh!
I didn't mean to set that. Yo, Master Duel, bro, you're trolling me. I have to do it differently now. I, I, bro, I was just pressing the card. This is, uh, quality Yu-Gi-Oh. I was just pressing the card, man. I was not trying to set it. Oh, I break this whole board, too. I'm gonna make his maxi worthless. Ah, <sighs> Master Duel, Master Duel, Master Duel. I'm not used to the misclicks. Uh, the one downside to auto simulator is exactly what happened. Yeah, bro. Like, I didn't even mean to set it. You guys saw, like, I was literally pressing it to show you guys what I was going to do. And then it just sets. And I'm like, no. He's going to go 3-4. Shureg? You know what's funny? Is if he Shuregs here on the evenly match, I'm not even mad. Please do it on the evenly match, the set card. Nice! Wait, he's really just going to battle phase. Sure. I can activate C effect. Sure, actually, that's not bad. Oh, okay, Revolt, sure. He can't even go into another Shurig, though. Shurig is almost per turn. So I guess he can go four into Shurig and attack over A. Sure, I'll take it. I don't. That does not matter for me. Yeah, yeah, let's see. That's fine. Yeah, like, I can't believe I won that, but to be honest, I was going to win that regardless. That misplay was really bad, but I was going to win that regardless. Because I A add C back, I normal summon C, I attach B, and then I break his entire board. Literally, that Link 5 Underworld Goddess that I was saying is so hype in this deck is broken because the underworld goddess alone breaks that entire board by the way it literally breaks that entire board bro this is what i said we lose the die roll doesn't matter we're going second anyways yeah so uh can we go five win streak we're at two right now at the moment he can do whatever he wants i don't even care i have a kaiju i literally have a kaiju for whatever this is why you play kaijus i literally have a kaiju for whatever striker monster he puts on here his back row becomes dead or i just evenly him this is so good abc is so good in master duel bro Literally, he can do whatever he wants. Like, I do not care what he does. Oh, okay. Well, if he's going to end on a trash board, that kind of makes me sad, to be honest. Is he passing? Oh my god, he's actually passing on that. If I evenly, like, what am I going to evenly him for two? No, I'd rather just hit the back row. I think he hit the Widow Anchor earlier. So, if this is just Widow Anchor, I'm pretty sure I just win. Oh, yeah, that's exactly. I win. Literally outs it. He doesn't get Ray. I win. Yo, I hate to say it, but crafting the terraforming was worth. I really didn't want to craft terraforming, but it was worth. Uh, we're gonna go e chain link one B, chain link two C. No, wait. I want to do chain link one B, C. How do I? Chat. How do I switch the chain links? How come it made me do B first? Can someone tell me why they I can't chain differently? All right. A lot of these mistakes are because I don't know how apparently this works. Oh, bro, this makes it so bad. I have to go into something really awkward here. Where's your unicorn? I don't have a unicorn yet. I never got to one. Oh, bro, I have to do it this way. Why was... Yo, can someone explain to me if you guys know how to choose the chain links? Like, why did it make me chain... Why did it make me do chain link 1 as B? Like, that's weird. Like, it didn't give me the option to press C. It only made, gave me the option to press B. It's so weird, man. You can't choose the chain in that way from this game in my experience. Why? I don't know. Doesn't it usually ask what you want to trigger? It does, but it said, do you want to trigger B, not C? Anyways, we're fine here. We're like, we're not in the best situation, to be honest, but we're fine. This has to be sent to the graveyard for the effect, right? Yeah, but it's getting banished, so that's not a problem. I have a chalice still. Hopefully that's useful enough. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that was so awkward, man. That almost actually threw the duel. That almost actually threw the duel. But it's okay, we won. We're bronze tier 3. Oh my god. Literally within... We're 3 and 0. Oh, uh, I didn't see. Oh, he's making us go first? Okay. Not great, but playable. I think I keep the Chalice in hand for Buster. I'm not going to negate that. He's playing Blue Eyes, bro. It's all brick. His whole hand is bricks right now. Okay, this I think I actually have to negate, though. Yeah, because he gets alternative. I mean, I could max C the ult when he goes alternative, but there's no point in getting... Yeah, I'm just going to negate this. He goes neg 2. He loses 2 cards for that. He lost the blue eyes, and he lost the melody. Should I just max C him for the polymerization? I feel like this is really bad. I'll uh, just max C him. Yeah, like, I feel like I should have maxed him, but, like, whatever, I guess. I mean, this lets you special summon another fusion thing, right? I'm very confused with what's going on right now, to be honest with you. Okay, on summon here, I get to draw. Of course, of course I draw one. Like, of course I draw Buster. All right, so here's what I'm doing. I'm going to go, I'm just going to break the board now so he can't play. Buster chain link one uh, to discard one card and banish the face down. I'm going to activate IP number two and I'm going to activate Buster number three. There we go. This is a standard combo. This is all without hanger, by the way. So like, I, I, I'm happy I finally get to show you guys the actual combo. And then IP, I'm going to make this. 
using this one, two, three, four, and five. I'm gonna keep the C on board actually. Uh, I'm not gonna use A here. See, look, by the way, guys, this is what I mean. Why is it not letting me use C first? I wanna use B. Forgot Underworld, Goddess, that's nasty. That's what I'm saying. That's why this deck is insane. Like, that's literally why this deck is so crazy. What if you send them to the grave in a different order? Oh, so if I want to go chain link 1C, chain link 2B, I send C first? I have no idea, but maybe. I'll try that. You know what? I'm going to try that this next one. All right, this is probably going to be our last duel. Let's see if we can hit that 5 win streak. Oh, he's making me go first? Brother, stop making me go first. I mean, this is still playable. Okay, this is actually the perfect time to test this. Okay, this is the perfect time to test this. All right, so if I want to do that, let's go chain link 1C, chain link 2B. Let's try it this way. Oh, yeah, C chain link 1. Oh, shit. You were right. Yo, you were right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So C1, B2. Okay, okay, good. So I have to remember that, though. So I have to go... It doesn't really matter what I add to my hand. Okay, so I have to send them to the graveyard in the order I want them to chain. Good to know. Good to know. That's so jank. Yeah, it is jank. That's very jank, but whatever. But that's so annoying, especially in a deck like ABC where I have to make sure... Because the chain links matter in ABC, right? The problem is with this hand is the Gamma Seal does nothing for me at the moment. I don't know why he wanted to make me go first. And he's playing Dark Magician. Why would he want me to go first? Yo, I feel like if I just get rid of this, he just loses. I'll save the IP for whatever he summons. I think that's the play. Yo, EDO Pro has been around for how long? And Konami couldn't program master duel to just let you press chain link one chain link two like that's so weird oh yeah guys we're getting five win streak sorry all right so i'm gonna go buster tribute itself sign back the pieces the ip doesn't really do anything for me here because he set a monster which is weird but whatever next turn i'll just go into access code make phoenix pop make uh access code and just win oh yeah activate phoenix yeah five win streak easy money get rid of that who knows what it could be? Activate B. Yes. Oh, see now. See, I didn't pay attention to the chain links. Like it doesn't matter in this case, but I have to start l learning to pay attention to that because that really does matter. Climbing is not that bad. I don't even have a full deck. I'm missing half my extra deck, and we can do this. Nice, good job. I'm happy with today's episode actually, or today's stream, I should say. I said episode because I was thinking about the YouTube video. Yeah, okay. I think today we had a really good episode. I think there's going to be some changes and some tweaks happening. We do have some dust now, which is kind of nice. So we can do some things. I do want to prioritize staples before anything. But yeah, like stuff like Triple Nova is not going to happen. Like eventually I'll get a Zeus. Eventually I'll get a Dweller. Because once we get to higher ranks, those are going to be very, like, very necessary. I guess thank you guys for watching. Have a good night, guys. I appreciate every single one of you. And with that, Spanko, signing out. Peace.